I'm not like this, okay? Don't kill me, please. Always easy, easy. Howdy, viewers. Brad, proprietor of our Stool Entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 challenge video. In this case, it's Bandit Challenge number three, where you have to rob four stores in one day. And if you plan it out right, it's very easily done. So let's get on with this challenge and how I did succeed. First off, you want to start in Valentine first thing in the morning. Sleep in the hotel, get up, then get ready to steal. Now, before you start your first robbery in Valentine, go to the map. And what you want to do is place a marker by Wallace Station. And I'll explain that once we begin the first robbery, or after the first robbery, actually. And the first person you're going to rob is the doctor. And you want to bring your horse behind here because you can get a faster escape once you rob the doctor. Morning, partner. You're going to want a mask up for this. So once you put the mask on, ah, yeah, unfortunately, auto save. You're going to walk into the doctor's office. Listen, I don't see the I need don't for treat that map here. This is a robbery. Open the register now. Do what you want. But let, let me live. You son of a bitch. All right, whatever you say, I'll open it right up. I used to be like you. Then I decided to help folk. You try and make an honest living. Unfortunately, once you walk out with a mask on and they realize you just robbed the doctor, they're going to call for the police. So you hide your horse back here, you jump on, and you ride away. And you want to get out of the investigation crime report area and you're just going to work your way toward Wallace Station but like I said you want to get out of the area let the investigation die down and come back. The investigation quickly ends and the stores are not in lockdown so bring Arthur back into Valentine and you want to get him into the area behind the doctor area where you just rode out of. In fact, what you want to do is put the horse right where I'm going to put it. And you want to enter the shop by its back entrance. Get that mask off in my store. Now. Open that thing. Now. I got youngins. Oh my no. God. Don't get squirrely. I'll open this up. This is the way you make your money. Real kind. Thank you. I'm going to close this shop. I've had enough. Okay, whether you're witnessed or not, it doesn't matter. Run over to your horse and start riding toward Wallace Station. In fact, keep riding to Wallace Station because that is your next place where you're going to rob a store.
Wallace Station has the, the little general store in it. And yeah, you're going to walk in and rob him. Policy in this here store. Hey, come on. What's the mask for? You put that gun away. I think you better open up that register. Oh, Not like this, okay? Don't kill me, please. Always easy, easy. I'll give you what you want. Without this money, you're making me starve. You ain't scaring nobody. This is mighty fine of you. Work hard and save folks just to steal it. So far, there's been witnesses, but Arthur has his face masked, and he can flee. In this case, you want to get riding away and take your mask off. It might help a little bit, but now on the map, your next target is the grocery store at Strawberry. And this is where things are going to get a little tricky. Now, unfortunately, these lawmen are going to spot Arthur, and I'm going to try and have him ride out. One of the things you don't want to do is ride into Strawberry being pursued by lawmen, because what happens is Strawberry is locked down now, and you can do nothing. You wouldn't be able to do your fourth robbery. So what you got to do is head away from Strawberry, and ditched the lawmen in order to go back into Strawberry. Okay, I've ditched the lawmen. I've got a bounty of 10 bucks, but I can ride into Strawberry. And essentially, I'm going to pay off the bounty and then go rob the store. I mean, this is pretty easy. And it's quickly done. You saw it was like 1 o'clock. So yeah, I got another, oh gee, 11, 10 hours to do something in. Hey there. You Hector? That's me. Alden tells me you're a discouraged man. Ah, you must be a friend of that Josiah Trelawney. All right. In that case, I've got something here you might want to take a look at. Mm hmm. <laughs> okay, I just want to rob a store, not the coach. So I'm going to pay the $10 bounty and get the hell out of here and rob the general store. Well, now. Hey there, girl. All right, I got folks to check in on. Check in. Hello? How goes it? No point for me. Well, ain't that damn Listen, you can't have them. Okay, then. Open the register right now. Yes, go, go ahead and take whatever you need. Just a small business in a small town.
there you go four stores in one day and so far no one's witnessed arthur he can get on his horse and get the heck out of here rob any three coaches or return any three stolen coaches to the fence in a day that is the next challenge i'm going to cover if you found this video informative hit the thumbs up button feel free to leave some comments if you like this type of video hit the subscribe button and bell icon i post four video game related videos a week plus some shorts and specials and you want to stay informed as always thanks for watching thanks for subscribing and thanks for stopping by Thank you.